And this is just a slow... It's just starting off like a really slow end for Titan. But once they engage, it's going to be fast. Very fast. Yeah, no, this is exactly... They're going to gather up, as you, guys, as you guys can see, rather. Existence will lurk in wow. mid. And the rest of them will just start pressuring forward onto this A site. Maniac, of course, in squeak. Crims is trying to hold it, but Kenny, is already, he's going to find Pronax, actually. That was by Sandbags in mid. Almost no bullets there for Crims, and he ends up going down in Sandbags. JW getting overrun as well. Titan looking strong in this pistol, and Olofmeister missing a couple of shots. He's got one left. Going to have to reload right here, and he's going to do it quick as well. Flusher, they're grouping up. The bomb has been planted. Apex also not going down, and Fnatic not hitting their shots right now, it seems. They're just buying so much time right now, Titan. There we go. Flusher manages to take out Kenny S, but it's still a 2v3, and the flank is coming in from existence as well. Not going to be necessary, though. Apex decides to take things into his own hands. Plant some, uh, what is it, some wheat? There we go. Yeah, whatever they can they can get for the winter. Just uh, stack up on it. Great grenades <laughs> in there. <laughs> Flusher's gone, and so is Pronax with a headshot here. There is he no head armor, in fact, or no armor at all on Olofmeister. So if he shows up, he's got to be careful, but Titan are actually very low at this point in time on health. Could be a little bit scary. Shots going through, and they get spotted out, but Crims managed to catch RPK out at range. Nicely done there. They're trying to wrap back around towards the A site now, Titan, but this has been long enough for Fnatic to start picking up on this. They're rotating back. JW's in position with that CZ. Looks for that long-range shot, and Maniac has got four HP. There you go. One goes in. JW just wreaking havoc right now. Two kills. Maniac comes back, but this is a two-on-two, -two, and the life lead is very firmly on Fnatic's side right now. They've got plenty of HP. Oh, it's so close. All of Meister chasing down, but a flash goes out. He can't quite find the kill. He hits. No, he doesn't actually. Maniac still alive on four health there, and Crims now jumping to look for Kenny, but he ends up going down just barely. And not using it yet, but they do have the, the boost going on on the side that we are talking about. Two people boosted up here. Existence ends up going down, so no flashbang, no tech nine either just yet. JW did get headshot falling off that box, tries to get back her. Oh, running into the ladder. That took a second too long, and then he's gone. No, not the most effective HE there by Pronax, and Apex with a great shot onto Pronax thanks to that AWP. Titan are winning this round. This is absurd. Fnatic, they should have been off to a much better start to this round, but they lost so much mid control, and RPK comes up from Speedway. To take down Flusher, Crims, I don't know what he could do at this point. He has to run away. And having lost Maniac, who's a very heavy hitter right now for Titan, this is going to affect them. Existence walks into vents, but got spotted out by Crims. 35 seconds left here for the French to do something. And Kenny and Existence coming back, turning this into a three-on-three. -three. Two big kills, and it's going to be all about the A site here. Pronax trying to play close here, walking into the fire. It's going to be really careful, two health on him. But are they realizing where he is? Existence now covering Speedway. Might be able to catch Crims. He will catch Crims. And still alive, just buying time. And they know exactly where Pronax is. They're going to get the kill as well there. Titan are playing really well. And Kenny picks up the last kill there. Triple in total. And they aren't quite on point right now. Just in the straight up one to one fights, we expect them to land those shots and you know be able to win out there. They just aren't doing that right now. Titan, they're besting them in every sense. Yeah. Uh, case in point is JW taking a long time to find that kill. But Crims did pick up a very crucial kill there on Maniac. So it's still a 3v3. Apex planning in the far left corner of this bomb site. And he's got the Molotov for upper as well. JW is going to be no entrance here. In fact, he's going to burn alive. Oh. He couldn't make it out in time. The flames are going to catch him. And now Olaf Meister trying to see if he retake this bomb site. Going to take down RPK. He spots out Apex, and Apex is going to go down. And now Kenny is in a worst possible position. He can't stop these defuse no matter what happens. Gonna get the one kill in. And Crims not defusing yet. He's waiting. Oh no, what's happening? Kenny walks in. And I think this is. He doesn't have time. I think it's just gonna be enough time here. Just in the very last second. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> now the force buy, the force buy desperation buy is coming in for Fnatic, basically. These these are desperation buys. I mean, two rifles, an AWP, and two pistols like this. They don't have that much to work with, but Olafmeister winning a crucial duel at the beginning to get that entry frag to take out Apex. The risk might buy, actually might pay off here. Oh, Did they spot him? I think Maniac literally just spotted them going for that boost. I'm not sure. Uh, you got to wonder at this point. Maniac nope. walking in, and he's not really aware there. Right on top of him, Crims. Going to get the kill regardless, and now tries to fall back down again. Five health left, ends up dropping. And they do have JW now boosted up. Going for the quick shot there, not going to hit it on Kenny. And Kenny in return, still alive inside. He doesn't get the no-scope this time. Our existence should be waiting for RPK here. This is actually a 
a big advantage right now for Titan. Assuming existence can stay alive, but he can't. And now RPK coming up from behind is going to have some, some issues here. And JW, does he get that spot? Yes, he does. He gets spotted out. HE on top of JW. Max damage nade. And now Ulfmeister's only got 15 HP as well. This is a winnable situation for RPK. Walks around the corner, but Ulf has got the AWP and does not miss that shot. Triple kill for him at the end of the round. And it's two, and the smoke is going to be pretty well timed here. Oh, there's the flash through, and this is really clever. Pronax, just nothing he could do. Completely flashed white. And this is actually calamitous for, for they, Fnatic. They cannot lose this round. If they do, their money gets reset and Titan just completely run away with his half. It is yeah. now or never for Fnatic. They have to step in and actually start landing some shots, but these smokes going down just making their lives so difficult here. Apex boosted up there. Really strong headshot coming out. The flusher going down. Molotov here to buy even more time. And Fnatic have to run away. Well, this call coming out from Fnatic is looking good right now because the closest member to A right now, apart from Apex, is Existence. So Apex has to stay alive for a very long time. And when he sees those, those smokes, he's going to call it. He knows, or they should know, what's coming up. But they're still not moving. They're staying here. And Apex still gets the kill and escapes. This is ridiculous. And in the middle, Existence Titan are still winning this round in spite of being completely out of position. Yeah, this is, this is, when, this is when Titan are basically fired up right now. Olfmeister gets dropped down to half HP. No Kevlar for him. Only the Tech Nine. There's the Molotov to back court to the to quad boxes. That's going to force them out into the open. And this is all just going to be the retake now. Pronax doing the best that he can to keep his team in this game. But Existence walks forward, eliminates Olfmeister, and it's down to Pronax. Last man alive here. One v four, trying to hold on, but it's just not meant to be. Titan will take it 12-4. Yeah, that makes us happy. <laughs> you can tell the excitement. He smoked off chart but it was a great angle <laughs> yeah that is a very cool smoke but now they need to land the shots and the tech nines they're not quite getting the trick done here jw he's gonna be dancing around but so long as maniac can stay alive and he drops the bomb bomb behind quad boxes and the rotation coming through here the remaining member rpk just trying to get here fast enough maniac staying alive he's on his heels and there's the touchdown nade onto Pronax as well. Down to 50 HP. RPK with this MP9 more than well equipped. He's even got the incendiary if he wants to force him out in the open. If he wants to force the issue, but he's going to the HE instead. Touchdown nade! Uh, Tech 9 yeah. and JW, I mean, they're really just stretching as best they can. And it, is, it, is it going to just be the full out, all out YOLO rush? And it looks like it. They're going barreling into the A halls right now. And it doesn't look like they're going to stop. They're just going to go straight out. And this is it. You know, can they get in position in time? Double Whoa. Molotov, full flambe. And there you go. It's delicious. <laughs> it's all over. Maniac with the double Apex with the double. And that is Titan taking Fnatic in two maps. And both of them were super convincing. That is, that is incredible.